Welcome back to Sticker Mountain! In today's quick tutorial, we are going to show you how you can create a rectangular die line for your sticker using Adobe Illustrator. Let's get started. First, and this is the easiest step, open up your design in Illustrator. For this example, we are going to create a 3 by 2 inch rectangle sticker. Next, we are going to resize our artwork to fit inside of the 3 by 2 inch rectangle. We are going to size it down by 0.25 inches smaller than the sticker. To do this, click on your artwork, then go up to the dimensions at the top of the screen and type 2.75 inches next to the W or the width. Make sure that your dimensions are locked so that you don't accidentally warp your artwork. Next, we're going to center the artwork. In the Align panel, go to the Align Objects section and press the vertical and horizontal align buttons. This makes it easier to align the rectangle over top later. Next, we are going to select the Rectangle tool on the left-hand side. Click on an empty space on your artboard, and a dialog box will pop up requesting the dimensions for your rectangle. We are going to put 3 for the width and 2 for the height. Next, press OK. Here's a neat tip. If you want to create curved corners, double-click on the little circle on the inside of the corner. The Transform panel will pop up, and from there, under Rectangle Properties, go to the Corner Type section, and type in 0.125. This is the standard corner radius, but you can input whatever you like. Finally, we are going to align the rectangle horizontally and vertically so that it lines up with the artwork. Now, if you're doing this on a fresh page, you may notice that your artwork might have disappeared. No worries. With your rectangle selected, go to the Color panel and turn the Fill color off by clicking on the square with the red line through it and then click on the stroke color and change that to black. And that's it. You now have a sticker ready to be printed. Wondering what to do next? Head over to Sticker Mountain and we'll make that sticker design into a reality. Want to learn how to create die lines for other shapes? Check out this playlist here. See you next time, Yetis.